Well, we have an emergency, my friends. We gotta go to Florida. Last minute trip to Florida. Just booked a ticket. I woke up at 145. I traded from 215, the CPI numbers, from 215 this morning to about six live on YouTube. And the goal is to get to Florida and day trade tomorrow morning and not miss the open. One of the perks of having Sky Miles member with Delta being a Sky Miles member is with my status is I get access to the Sky Clubs and it's always nice before a flight to get some food, get a couple drinks, all for free with having the status. To explain exactly what a mochi is, but ice cream wrapped in a sweet rice paper. So we got about an hour until the flight takes off so we're just relaxing here in the Sky Club. It's actually pretty dead. I'm like the only one in here right now because it's early in the morning and most of the flights out of Hawaii take off in the afternoon or I'd say later at night. So most of the flights are red eyes back to the mainland. A lot of the flights are coming in in the morning and then flying out at night from Honolulu. Okay, so one of my favorite things to do is every time I fly, I always forget to bring an iPhone charger. And we're gonna get ready to get on this plane five hour flight to Seattle. I'm not sure if this is the full lay down seats or it's normal seats. We're gonna find out here in a second. Hopefully it's the lay down seats in first class. We just got to our seat 4D. The benefit of this seat is it fully flattens out. You can lay flat like you're laying in a bed. So we are in our seat now. You can check out the... Got our little TV. If you're gonna fly and you're gonna fly anywhere over an hour, at this point and you gotta make money right you gotta enjoy life play hard live hard hard living play living first class if you're not flying first class i'm not flying i'll fly mid-tier sometimes but if i can it's definitely going for the first class and i've been a delta customer now for like 10 years so i've got pretty good status and history with them so i've been awake since 1.45, I woke up this morning, 1.45. It's currently two or three in the afternoon, Hawaii time. So I'm gonna try to take a little nap. We got the lay down and uh, hopefully can sleep for a few hours before we get to Seattle. We have made it to Seattle. We gotta get to our next flight. We got about an hour layover here in Seattle. And then we got our last flight. Second Sky Club of the day. A little nicer than the one in Honolulu. Grabbing some food. Get some drinks, got some cookies over there as well. So just getting fueled up for the next flight. It's a five hour flight from Seattle to Orlando. So we got five more hours. We did five hours from Hawaii to Seattle and now five hours from Seattle to Orlando and we're finally home. So one more flight, one more flight. I'm tired, I'm exhausted. I had like 20 cookies and I don't want any more cookies. I gotta get out of the Sky Club. I've never understood why people want to stand right in front of the fucking entrance when they're not gonna even be able to get on the plane. Like no matter what, you're not gonna get on the plane no matter how close you stand to the entrance. The zone is called. It just blows my fucking mind. New plane, new seats, new first class, new TV. Maybe we get a new movies, let's see. It was kind of funny. I posted on Twitter, I had uh, you know first class seats, and people were literally commenting like, "That's not first class. You're not in first class." Made it to Orlando, Florida. It's currently 7:30 a.m. here in Florida, which would be. Uh, Almost, what, midnight in Hawaii? Four hours, I got like a few hours of sleep on that last flight, but definitely not getting in the full amount of sleep that I need. Also, the stock market is down big right now. The S&P overnight, Credit Suisse, and uh, European banking stocks taking a big dump overnight, so, or I guess today for the European session. We'll see what kind of action we get today. 8 a.m., we got an hour and a half to make it to the house. I kind of need to go by my Nana's house to get the microphone. I don't know if it's worth it to try to upgrade the microphone before the market opens. Try to get the X6 
the car that I had last time when I was here, but instead we got the X5 here. Do, 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 do. do a little walk around, film. Do a little walk around, film the whole thing. Make sure there's no dents or any massive holes or anything like that, but still a nice car. BMW X5 here. I really enjoyed the X6 the last time I was here. So I was like, oh, can I get the X6? And they're like, nope. But you can get the X5. So I know we talked about at the beginning of the video, the emergency that I had to go back to Florida. The emergency of going back to Florida is for one simple reason. It's my Nana's 87th birthday today. She's turning 87 years old today. She has no idea that I'm coming home. She has no idea that I even thought about coming home. So I am a big old birthday present heading to my Nana's. We're gonna go to my Nana's house right now, grab the microphone, wish her a happy birthday. I brought her a lay as well from Hawaii. So Nana's getting laid today, baby. Text my Nana, sent her a text saying, happy birthday, wish I was there to celebrate, maybe next year. So we'll see. If she gets that before, I don't know if she like sits there and reads her iPad every day, but maybe. We're about five minutes away. Five minutes away. All right, let's see. Let's see what she sees. Let's see. Hello? I just scared her. What are you doing? You got a letter here. You got a note there. A note. Someone left you a birthday present. Oh, I'm here! Surprise! 87 years old. Can't miss this one. Oh, oh Nana. I just flew halfway across the world. I on your know birthday. you did. I know you did. Oh. Operation Surprise Nana worked. She was very surprised. I gotta run though, because now I gotta get home so I can trade. I got the microphone. I don't know if I have time. It's right now 8 40. 8 40 in the morning. I wasn't really planning on trading the open anyway, but we'll see if we make it there. So the office, it's currently 9.10 in the morning. 9.10 right now, 9.10 a.m. We gotta turn everything on. Turn the computer on. Computer still works. Turn the lights on. Do -do 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 -do. Turning on the background, turning on the lights. All right, all right. All right, all right, all right. What else we got here? Lights, camera, action, baby. It's 920, we made it for the live stream. About to start streaming and we're gonna go live here on YouTube. Let's go all the way from Hawaii yesterday to Orlando today, baby. Hawaii, yesterday we got to uh, Orlando and we made it happen, so. I think mission accomplished. It's kind of cold here, actually. I thought it'd be warm. It's been hot in Hawaii, but it's actually kind of cold here. So, just uh, gonna get some things done. I gotta do some errands. I'm gonna go to dinner with my grandma tonight, my Nana, her 87th birthday. She's really excited. She's happy that I'm here. And I think that was worth it in general, like just being able to make it here for her birthday, to see the surprise on her face. She was definitely surprised. She had no idea I was coming, so um, that was cool. That was fun. You know, she's done a lot for me, so it's cool to be able to spend her birthday with her and fly back here to Orlando and make her day a little bit better, you know? Nothing wrong with making your grandma's day a little bit better. Market was kind of crazy today in a crazy range, made a little bit of money, but it definitely was a battle. It was up, it was down, I was up, but you know, it's just how it goes. You gotta take profit, Patrick. So there it is, we're locking it in, we're done. I'm gonna get the microphone set up, I'm gonna go run the errands, eat some Chipotle, and just keep on working. And then hopefully I can go to sleep tonight and get on Florida schedule time-wise, because it's about a six hour difference from Hawaii but uh, I basically live on the East Coast time in Hawaii. So there it is. Peace to the Middle East.